everyone <clears throat> good morning how was our night i hope you slept well just like the way i did because i had to sleep um yesterday evening i tried solving this assignment myself for the first time it was my first attempt so i tried recording directly but i had some challenges the the video was not clear because i tried to reduce the um, quality of the frame per seconds but i discovered that it's affected the quality a whole lot i discovered that it affected the the quality a whole lot so now what do i have to do first let me appreciate my brother Aurora, no, Aurora, Bamila. <coughs> it's 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 a great delight and i was so proud that he is on the group because he was the one that suggested this mouse you know compared to yesterday that you couldn't see where i hover on where you go to i know that this video will be clearer so um it's also a blessing in disguise i did the recording the recording wasn't sharp so it took me a little while but it's also a blessing in disguise because it will make me go straight to the point now. We need to have a lot of ASU on how to download, how to do this, and then having to wait for the internet to load will be out of it now. So I will just show you a few things to do, how to download it, how to how to go about getting all these shapes. So now <clears throat> going straight to the assignment. First, yesterday I was able to figure out some things. I'll show you the one I'd make before I go into the design, but I just wanted to figure out one of the things I discovered. And before I go, I would like to also add this. Uh, I've always heard um, this quote, imitation is limitation, but I can tell you that I am not really a fan of that word, that statement, that imitation is limitation. I believe that even with um, imitation, you can get a better perfection, especially when it is creatively applied. So you, I've seen a lot of people creatively applying solutions to this assignment and it was awesome. All because they, had, they let creativity to drive them as they were imitating. So, imitation is not totally limitation. Don't be scared to imitate. And also, don't be scared to innovate. If you can't get this directly, you can create your own. So, anyway, let's, without wasting much of our time, let's go to how to design this assignment straight up. It's very easy now. You know, I've done it once. If I had not done it, I would have shown you some of the mistakes I made and some things I do. So, I will just, I will just try to recap that very fast so that we can all see and i hope i know i know at the end of this you will you will know how to operate especially the logo pit so and i will also introduce us thereafter to the sketch part and showing us the interface how it could be used how you can get and what you get out of it so let's focus on the assignment now thank you now look at this um <clears throat> this work if you look closely you discover that because i screenshot it so i don't know where how to but if it's going to look like this my phone is quite rectangular i don't know what length it is but i know that this is at least like a whatsapp status or an instagram story so i will use that as the template compared to the one i did yesterday the one i did yesterday was on scape background so it's not a crime but at least so that i can look so close to what i have here so that's why i'm doing that um sorry sorry about that um snoozing sniffing of my nose for this moment because i might be doing that a little bit my i'm having a running nose a bit <coughs> all right now <clears throat> so let's go to the class um yeah let's go to the class uh, i mean to the canvas so that we can design it so you can see this is from the screenshots i screen grabbed it now the work i did yesterday it is i wanted to first see that you can see 
it's close to what we made that was made so this is what i could make so and i will show you what i did and how i do did mine you see mine is even a little bit beautiful i told myself yesterday but <clears throat> this is query it's not exactly like the one that was on the page so i don't know maybe i should make this you know what let me make this but i will show you what i would have done better and even i take some things into consideration so let's let me make this back for us so that we can learn exactly the way i made this compared to trying to imitate that again all right so let's let's go back let's go to let's go to let's go let's go let's go back yes so we're coming to to the home page where I always put my logo, logo pit on my app. So now, logo pit, here we come. Um, if I see that some things are taking much time to load, I will try to pause the camera. I don't and um, the recorder, so I don't want it. So yeah, here we have. Because I'm creating a new design, you should know that I won't have. I don't need to reload anything. So I just go straight to create new. Now um like i said remember that it is not square in nature what we designed and it is more like an instagram story for your phone so this is quite better if you use a whatsapp status concept but because i want to remake that same mistake i make so that you can all see it i will have to i won't use instagram story neither will i use flyer these two they look closely closely alike they would have helped me much better but you know let's just go and use the logo i've told you i always love working with this case so let's go so now <clears throat> um we are going straight to the next thing on the list um before i continue i told you about layers so i would like to explain how layers will be applied in solving that design um, okay okay sorry I, I shouldn't have visited totally okay let me let me work with the original so you'll be seeing it from the original so you must always try to keep um, your work at hand like um keep the work you're working on and when you see good design please try to screen grab it it's very beautiful you see one thing i like about this is beautiful and unique color straight up is one and also look at the um what's it called the pattern um, the font the font was just one you see that's what makes creativity better it's not how much noisy it looks don't make your page too noisy your graphics too noisy it doesn't really attract the high reserve most of the detail to the background you can try to create something that reference maybe something this might be the first page then you can try to create something at the side that that one the, it's get referred to so that one could be more detailed but let's let's just let's just go this is a very good ui user interface graphics that can always attract your customers to your product now let's let's go straight to to what i want to explain now this is this is just like a book so if you want to operate and do this just think of those layer as books so if we think of this as book which one is over the other you can see that this um shape yellow shape um rectangle is actually over here it was over this white background so and also these letters were all over this so and also this image i call it um um, silhouette you need to know that they are silhouettes they are silhouettes so when you are searching you can use silhouettes but if you don't know the right grammar just type shadow 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 man or something shadow man begging shadow man asking you find something very close something very close so and then this 
image so now let's go straight back to how to use it so the one that comes above the background is this first then we can arrange this in any order you can start with this you can start with this so and then the text i wanted to know about the text this is who is genuinely saved let's make sure now you see we have three different patterned um text here now it's even four because you see this genuinely so that you can have it arranged do you get it in such a way that you'll be able to put them underneath themselves you can write this who is together because of the same size and this one looks quite smaller to the who is so and then the saved is quite bigger so those are things you consider when you are making <coughs> your design now let's go to the design this might take a longer video but i will compress it certainly trust me i will go online to try to solve that for us online go pit yeah now the background is already white so i can take the advantage of that white without needing to change any color of my background so let's just go and <coughs> sorry um use what we need many people imported the image try to you know work with it try to crop sorry to fade in try to fade out we all did well in fact it works for many people use tools i i have not even touched in my life so you know, that's one thing with graphics app you can't exhaust tools you just keep learning every day now look at these layers you know i talked about it look at the beneath here you see what is happening so look at it again so this will let you know that this is what I mean when I say it's like a book, layers <coughs> that were arranged on themselves. So I will explain it much better when I start my work. Um, the first thing you need to do is that shape. So you use logo and then you must be connected to the internet to be able to use the logo. So click add logo. <coughs> Some people have already been giving me this corona. Yeah, you all did well. Now let's go to all. Now, in that whole section, somebody told me you couldn't get the shapes and like this is where you get your shapes. So the shapes is here. Now the shape, I will not want to make the mistake I make yesterday, so that we can go straight to the point. But I will try to reveal what was there. Now look at this. You can see that the square is still is the edge is blunt. It's not a perfect one. Now I will take you to another one. This one too is blunted. And it's quite obvious. Now, let me show you the one that is not very obvious that I made a mistake of. Look at this. It is not obvious. But let me show you what happened next day when I used it. Let me select it for now so that you can see. Um, because you did big payment, this is what happened. You see all these adverts coming up. Now, look at it. Look at this edge. Is not sharp. Look at the other edge. Excuse me. It's not sharp. Look at this too. It's not sharp. And look at this other part. It's not also sharp. So this is not a perfect fit. If I should use it, I will be having a blunted edge here. So I will. I will advise we switch and change this. This is very good for another design. Like, I will try to remake that um, NCGC logo again so that you can all see. This is a very perfect one that you can use because of the edge for those colored rectangles. So, let's let's close this and pick the better one. Yes. Now, <clears throat> I might try to cut it short so that we won't have long videos to download. Uh, then you won't get tired in the process all right okay so I'll, i will try to make each video 20 minutes each so i will be stopping it at 20 if it's going to be too long so 20 minutes for each video now um <coughs> are you here with me all right thank you for being here with me um what, what i want to show you is still adding that logo so let's go and pick the one we need so i've showed you that this one is not the one you need 
you can always know when you've downloaded the logo now let's go to the last one you need now look at this i'm very sure that this one is perfect i've tried it yesterday and also even while i was trying to refine as in research for that or that one this is what i find so now and i was designing it okay perfect too now you can see this is this is a perfect angle i don't have to rewrite i don't have to do anything now what color is it yellow so let's go for the yellow now i struggled with this yellow yesterday because i need something very yellowish so i was struggling how do i get that yellow so i i eventually find it it's not yet there so this wasn't there that's not it I think it's somewhere it's still a bit up and alternatively if you see you are struggling with the colors you can import that image itself then use the uh, colors um, dropper this like an eye drop that the one here so you you take it there and then you you pick the color so let me just show you how it will do look like if I pick a color from the color dropper. Now you see, that's the color dropper at hand. So if I want to pick a section, just I just go here. You can see it has changed. So let's say I, I pick this. Can you see that the, this color has changed? But I don't need it. I just want to show you how to use color dropper. So we can use it. I will use it in some of my other projects. So you will see what I'm talking about now um sorry about that sniffing once again so now let's let's go to to how to work on this <clears throat> i told you i said you can do more you can try to adjust your images by this or this but if you see that it's not centered and you want it to be centered from left to right just click this this will centralize it and if you think that it is not okay from right to left just click this i believe you got from up to down right to left is this top to down is this it's your center let's say let me show you okay if i automatically click this it's going to center it there. can you see so if i have skewed it too much and i click this to center it so <clears throat> does that make sense now yeah it makes so I don't really need all this. I just want to show you some things that we could do. Now, <clears throat> the work is not having any gradient. So see, it's a very good app to use. You are just to the edge. Now, <clears throat> to make the work closer to the one that was shown in the image I saw, you see space were well defined. This place, this is a perfect one and the height should have been caught somewhere here. But because you know, I said it, I didn't maintain the rectangle, I was working on a square background, so I would just have to work with what I have. So now, this is what we do we sh shrink it in a bit, okay? Let me adjust it a bit so that it's, it will still be closer a bit to what we have. Yeah, this is perfect. This will be better than the first one I did. Now, um, one thing I need you to notice with this app, you don't have to look at the outline or anything. The outline was out of it so the outline can come in later on when you want to do the design and you start adding the outline but i don't need outline for this project so why bother about it now let's go straight to the next one is my text so let's go to text i love using the text straight up now what do you do who is who is who is now after who is let's click hard now you can try to quickly adjust it so that because if you keep typing text it will be adding them on each other so try to be like who is who is how we, we will start let's add not to add another text we are going to be adjusting other properties later just put everything you need on top of this we can start arranging them later so that your work will be faster so who is um genuinely genuinely
no saved you see yesterday i made the mistake so i will intentionally make that mistake again so that you can all see what normally happen you can see i missed the question mark so now i'll tell you i intentionally made this mistake so that many people might be like ah if i made a mistake i would like don't be scared of making mistakes make mistakes there's always a way out there's either back or front you can always work your way out life is not that at the pause that you won't be able to figure a solution out don't be afraid to make mistakes now let's make sure now um let me check that let's for those who have seen the let's before I want to I want to know how it's written. Okay, apostrophe yes was there. Okay, that's what I want to confirm. And then okay, let's let me show you how so that you can see it too. Can you see it's apostrophe? Yes. Then also the L is capital. So we need to, to work with that so that we can do that. You know, I told you imitation is not totally a limitation, it makes you learn. If imitation is limitation, many of us won't even be speaking English. Yes, because you have to imitate A, B, C. So foundations in the beginning you must imitate. It's now as you grow you start applying creativity. So don't be scared to imitate. Alright. Let's oh it's already twenty. The video is already twenty, so I'll stop here. Let's make sure. Alright. Let's make sure. And there should be a space. <clears throat> now let's add this to it so you see what i what i meant when i told you if you don't arrange it properly it's all gonna then let me try to resize it a bit if i want to resize i can use my hand but i just i just felt let me show it to you how you can resize without stress just hold this angle let's see can you see now that's perfect perfect now it's all arranged already now how the next thing will have been how to bring the um, images in so how to bring all those image I need in you know I f I would have searched this up for the shape which I know that one way or the other might be there but you can also download it I'll show you some things but I'll show you let let me stop the video here so that it won't be too long for us to watch thanks i'll start i'll continue from there